Now new at five, significant progress for the college football player, paralyzed during a game against the University of Georgia. Devin Gales was wheeled off the field bad shape in September, but today he felt his feet. Channel 2's Taisha Fernandez was the only reporter to talk to him about this moment. Just grab it and fold it up. Picking up a cell phone and holding it up to his ear on his own is a huge step for Devon Gales. It's just amazing to know that feeling is coming back and I have a chance to walk in again. Nearly four months ago, the Southern University wide receiver suffered a severe spinal injury during a game against the University of Georgia. He was taken off the field on this stretcher and couldn't feel anything on his body. But now he can move both of his hands, some of his fingers, and just last night, he could feel his knee when Shepherd Center staff moved him from one chair to another. And when after I transferred, they hit my knee. And I was like, ow, I felt that. And then it had more feeling than I thought feeling the hair on my leg. And then Wednesday, he felt the bottom of his feet. His mom was there to witness. She was just pushing me, and I was like, okay, I feel that. And it was like just a weird feeling because I really didn't have the feeling before. So just to know I had a feeling coming back and I'm feeling the carpet, I was like, Okay, ooh, I like it. Gales has been living in this main part of the Shepherd Center since he was injured on September 26th. He's been making so much progress, he's moved to the residence center, which is more like independent living. Just to know that I can come in here and I can go in there and watch the TV when I want. Yeah. I go lay down. There's still people out there that's supporting me through this accident and knowing I'm getting better. It's just a blessing. That was Channel 2's Taisha Fernandez reporting, and it is certainly a blessing oh, that he's man. able to do that at this point. It's exciting.